Louis Pasteur. Louis Pasteur was a French biologist and chemist born in the year of 1822 in France. He studied philosophy for most of his life, but ended up earning his bachelor's degree in art and science. He became a professor at the University of Strasbourg for chemistry, where he met his wife, Marie Pasteur. Together, they had five children, but only two of them survived while the other three died of typhoid. Later, he became professor of geology, physics, and chemistry at a university in France. He started teaching with a class full of hopeful students, but as the year went on, every one of the students transferred out of his class because they didn't like him as a person. Morality was not his best quality. Anyways, when Louis was younger, he was well known for his studies on crystals, but his biggest discoveries came when he was older. Louis was best known for his discoveries on causes and preventions of diseases. He created the first vaccines for rabies and anthrax, which at the time was a groundbreaking discovery. He also patented the process of pasteurization, which gets rid of risks of disease in food. We still commonly use pasteurization today with foods such as eggs, butter, and milk. Louis has won eight different awards for his studies in pasteurization and vaccines. His most famous quote was, in the fields of observation, chance favors only the prepared mind, which means that if you're prepared, you'll do well. Another one of his quotes, it is surmounting difficulties that make a hero. This means that the obstacles that a person faces will help shape them into a better person. Although Louis was famous for creating the first vaccine, it was later proved that Henry Toussaint, a French veterinarian, was the one who really developed the first vaccine. He gave samples of his vaccine to Louis, who presented it to the French Academy of Sciences. This enabled Louis to sell the vaccines and take the glory from Toussaint. A couple years later, Louis had a severe brain stroke and the whole left side of his body was paralyzed, but he recovered and lived for 30 more years. He made a huge historical impact and has saved thousands of lives with his discovery. Even though he died in 1985 from a stroke, he's still saving lives with his vaccines to this day and we still use his method of pasteurization too. Thanks, Louis.